Alrighty guys, so I just made it to Salt Lake Airport. I am starting a block of seven days in a row. So tomorrow I have to do a turn. It's a three leg turn. So we're like consider it a turn, call it like a triangle. Anyway, I do that tomorrow and then I go to Calgary the day after. And then the trip after that is Seattle, Raleigh. So commuting in, this will be my last time commuting into Minneapolis, which is even better. I will miss Minneapolis, but not enough to continue to do this. It has been a job. But now I am heading to Starbucks to get the day rolling. Let's get rolling. I'll talk to y'all once I get out my coffee. Alrighty guys, I just made it into the crash pad. It is like 10.30 at night. We had a delay. It was not fun. We had an aborted takeoff due to like hot breaks. Whew. But anyway guys, now in the crash pad, about to go to sleep. We have a three leg day tomorrow, but it's just kind of like a turn. Well, I call it a triangle, but it's a turn. Uh, and then after that, I do a three day. So I'm probably gonna take you along this whole like four days instead of just doing like a turn because it's just a turn. It's not very exciting, but I did win $12 on Mega Million. So it was a good start to my day. Now I am about to crawl in the bed, go to sleep because I have to be up at 6 a.m. for an 8 a.m. report. So I'll talk to y'all. Good morning, everybody. So I am now on the train heading over to the um, airport today. But like I said earlier, we do the turn. Well, I guess a triangle. But we do the turn today, which won't be too bad. So, yeah. Let's get this day rolling. I will talk to y'all once I get on the plane. Alrighty, guys. So I just made it to the gate. Grab me a coffee. We're all set. Ready to go. First flight to Detroit. It is a full flight today. Which is not fun, but it'll be a short flight, so that's even better. I will most likely be assist. I am most junior, so I get whatever's left over. But anyway, guys, let's get this day rolling. I'll talk to y'all once I get it. Guys, so I just made it back to the airport. Sorry I did not film yesterday. I decided to have a gallbladder attack, and that was not fun. I went to the ER around like 7 p.m. Did not get done until midnight. Turns out I have gallstones, so I have to get it removed, which is not fun. But now I'm drinking a mint tea to try to help my stomach because it hurts and yeah let's get this day rolling guys we have three flights today over to Calgary already guys so we're now in Denver the flight went good I am still struggling with uh, stomach pain and it's not fun so you ever have gallstones don't know anything about them not fun at all I took ibuprofen that didn't help I'm taking a Tylenol that didn't help I went to the ER yesterday and I tried something stronger. That didn't help. So I'm just gonna have to tough it out until I can uh, get it removed later on this month, I hope. We have two more flights to go. We have to go back to Minneapolis, then off to Calgary. So I will talk to you guys soon. Alrighty guys, so we are now on the plane. Last flight of the day. I'm super excited. One more flight to Calgary. This flight is extremely light, so it'll be even better. Still in pain, but I talked to my dad. He says the pain is normal. He goes, after the attack, you tend to have really, really, really sore muscles. So it's probably that. Not fun, but it happens. So hopefully tomorrow I feel better. He said it usually only lasts a day. <sighs> I have a doctor's appointment scheduled for the second. I think it's the second. Anyway, the second or the third, I think it's the second to go talk to a new primary doctor so I can get referred to a surgeon to get my gallbladder out. Not fun. It's what I've been dealing with for the last week, guys, so that's why I haven't posted any videos. But let's get going. One more flight to go. I got this. Alrighty, guys, so I just made it into Calgary. I'm so excited. I'm about to crank this AC down, as you guys know. First thing you do when you get in a room, check for intruders. After there's no intruders, turn the AC down, because it's always hot. Um, I'm feeling so much better now. Um, my stomach still kind of hurts, but it stopped briefly when I was in the ear, which is even better. Stupid gallbladder, but I do have to get it removed, which is not fun. These flights were long, but guys, one bed, two beds. Yes, super excited. As you guys know, two beds, one to eat, one to sleep. But guys, this room is super, super cute. Let's take a look. All right, let's come on into the hotel room. Let's start in the bathroom. Hi, right, bathroom, it has the time, little like vanity light, which is nice. Normal shower. And then we go big closet, which is great. Full length mirror. We have one bed, two beds, TV, 
coffee pot. Let's go take a view of my room. And it's of the city, which is super exciting. But that's it, guys. I have 30 hours here. I really don't know what I'm going to do. It depends on how I feel tomorrow. If I am feeling good, I will go out and explore. If I am not, I'm going to lay in bed and bitch and moan all day long. But now I am going to change out of these clothes, take a shower, and go to bed. Because I am tired. So I'll talk to you guys in the morning. Morning, everybody. How are you? I am not doing well. But anyway, it is now the next morning. I guess now it's the afternoon. I think it's like noon. Um, I went to bed. Great. No issues whatsoever. Gallbladder was calmed down. I slept great. Woke up this morning. I felt fine. And then I had a candy bar and a Diet Coke because I was like, okay, cool, I'm fine. Let me just eat something a little bit. I didn't want to eat a full salad. Had that and it set off my stomach once more. So my gallbladder is acting up again. So I'm in pain. Really not fun. I need to go see this doctor as soon as possible to try to get this gallbladder out. My appointment is on the second and the second cannot come soon enough. Yeah, now I'm going to go try and walk to see if I can, you know, get all my body to digest this quicker so then I'd be back on an empty stomach then it won't hurt as bad. Ibuprofen's not working. Tylenol's not working. It is not fun. Um, yeah, now I'm going to go for a walk and take you guys around Calgary. peaceful it was great i like calgary i would come back to calgary if i wasn't in so much pain i would totally come back relatively soon but definitely thinking guys that i'm gonna have to have my gallbladder removed and i will be out of work for like two weeks not fun mom my mom's like no you only be out for like a week baby i don't know about that my dad was out for almost a month my mom was out for like two weeks so we'll see how that goes. But it's not fun. That walk did help a little. So it took some of that pain away. Ibuprofen kind of helps. Not really. Tylenol kind of helps. Not really. The stuff they gave me at the doctor didn't help at all. Even though it was a narcotic. So I don't know. Now I'm just going to chill out and relax. I have tea in the room. If it gets really, really bad or I'll take another bath. I took a bath this morning. But I'm going to go chill out and watch Netflix for like another hour or so. And just kind of take it easy because your boy is in pain. And I don't like being in pain. I'm a big baby, guys. I'm a really big baby. But all right. I'll talk to y'all either later on tonight or in the morning. I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to do. Hey guys, so it's been a few days now. I went back to the ER yesterday because I was having really, really bad gallstone attack again so i have a appointment with the surgeon to go get it removed on the second so in a couple days i will go down and see if i can get it removed if they'll let me and then uh, we'll go from there but i got pulled off my trip because you're not allowed to fly when you're on strong medication so that's not fun sorry guys this video wasn't too exciting but at least you guys saw a little bit of calgary between like the fits of pain that i was in but this is where i'm gonna wrap up the video today guys don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you're new hit that push bell notification so you guys can stay up to date with all my future adventures thanks guys i will talk to you all later bye